Hey everybody, for the last year I've been wearing these Nike Air Max 270 shoes and they are by far the most comfortable shoe I have ever walked in. They got this really aggressive air filled heel which makes it feel like I'm walking on a cushion of air, like a pillow or something, which is really cool for amputees. Um, but one of the problems with this aggressive heel is that when I put it on my prosthetic legs, it actually dorsiflexed me or pushed me forward. So I had to go in and make a plantar flexion uh, alignment adjustment to keep that nice 90 degree angle that I'm comfortable walking in. But it made me think about all the times that I bought shoes or sneakers just because they look good, but they weren't always the most comfortable to walk in because of the alignment issues. So I'm here uh, at Ability Prosthetics and Orthotics in Exton, PA to talk with my good friend, prosthetist uh, Julie McCulley, about some of the tips that we as amputees can do and use to keep maintain that proper alignment and, uh, and ensure overall comfort when we walk. So let's go talk to Julie. Hey, Julie. Hey. So here we have two of my favorite shoes. One has a heel and one <laughs> does not. Right, one's flat, one's the other. What advice can you give to uh, other amputees that don't have an adjustable ankle foot? Because I know some of you do have adjustable ankle feet. What advice can you give them to maintain proper leg alignment when they switch between different shoes? I would tell you, um, number one is to make an appointment just for that objective with your prosthetist. Um, it's really important to go through a lot of the shoes you're gonna be uh, potentially wearing and just to hear how to adjust those properly so that you know for the future, we know you're gonna get new shoes, we know you're gonna change your shoes, or we, and we want you to be able to and have the confidence and the knowledge to be able to do so and do it um, so that you don't develop wounds or discomfort. But. So and, and different heels have different stiffnesses yeah. is that correct right yeah that's absolutely correct um, if you have a heel of this height and you have a dress shoe of the same height they're gonna feel completely differently and your alignment is mm -hmm. gonna be very different with two shoes of the same heel height so that adjustable ankle although it may be adjusted to the right height mm -hmm. it may not be just quite right for the alignment depending on the stiffness now what about people who like to wear you know their skate shoes to flats like like these what do you suggest they do yeah. So yeah, that's and that's a good question. And uh, even change of season, we were talking about that mm -hmm. earlier. Um, you know, you want to wear your sandals, and then you want to jump into a pair of sneakers, maybe like this. Um, so how do you do that? To go to a lower heel height, uh, we oftentimes use um, what's called a lift, a heel lift. Um, we have adjustable heel lifts. Um, we have, if you know what height is going to have to be um, regularly, you can keep it in the shoe. Um, but we want you to be able to be a little dynamic in how things are um, progressing as far as changing your shoes and being in, as independent as possible. Mm -hmm. So alignment issues can equal comfort issues when you're walking. So that's straight talk coming from my girl, Julie McCulley, here at Ability Prosthetics. And I hope you guys all have a great day.